I've got a masculine here who um, wants you to contact them. That's the energy I'm picking up. They want you to contact them and they have been doing everything possible to either get your attention, spell work, manifestation. They've tried everything, but you're not getting it. You just don't understand that this person wants to communicate with you. Um, I feel that for a lot of you, you know exactly what I'm talking about, but this person did you dirty and your ego is not allowing you to communicate with them. Okay, so if that sounds like it's for you, let's see what our spirit wants to say about this situation. They are going to lose it. I'm telling you that they are... I feel that they are the ones that should contact... Look, keeping an eye on you. What did I say? For a lot of you, they might be um, checking out your... I don't know, your Instagram, Facebook, fucking... I don't know. But they're definitely checking you out. Um, but they want... This is, this is in an attempt to get you to contact them somehow. They believe that you guys are meant to be. That's what they think. That is what they think. There's a lot of emotions here. This person is being really ruled by their emotions. I don't think they realized that you would go this long without contacting them. And they're like, what am I, doing? What am I going to do with all these feelings? I need to get her to contact me. Do you know what I mean? I don't think, I feel they're going to have to make a move at some point, but they're afraid to be judged. They're afraid of coming in. They're being very, very defensive. They would rather you say something, but I don't think you're going to say anything either. Nah, this is very stubborn. Any stubborn. I say stubborn and the fucking emperor comes out. Could be dealing with an Aries energy here as well. Just saying doesn't have to be. Um, yeah, this person is being extremely stubborn. Although they want to contact, they don't want to be the ones to say anything because they know they're fucked up and they're afraid of what you're going to say. So they'd rather try and manifest your, their wish fulfillment, you to contact them. Why are they not? Oh, no, no, actually, are they going to make the move? Because I don't feel you guys contacting them at all. Will they make the move? They're afraid of you. They are afraid of, like, proper afraid. They are very much stuck in their head. They're, do you know what? They're obsessed with you. I know for a lot of you, you're like, yeah, Betty, feed my Delulu. Whoever this reading's for, this person's fucking obsessed with you because they know that you've kind of cut them off. They weren't expecting this. They thought you would, you, you would have contacted by now. So they're trying everything to get you to kind of, you know, say something, but they're not saying anything. They can't stop thinking about you. They've tried to move on. They have tried to move on, but nobody compares, compares to you. Could be a twin flame situation, bitch. Just saying. Just fucking saying. Tables are going to turn, okay? The Wheel of Fortune's here. And I do feel there will be a reunion. Some, there's definitely going to be a fucking reunion here. Fuck knows how, because you seem to be okay on your own. You're like, baby, I don't want this. Bitch. What's the advice for the collective on what to do in this kind of, in this fucking situation? What are you supposed, bitch, you're already thinking about them as well. You're already thinking about the past. This is a past, past wishy-washy. Look at that. Now you're being wishy-washy about whether you're going to take this person back, whether you really want to go um, back there again, because it was very, very painful. But at the same time, it was also very, very happy. Do you know what I mean? I feel you need to give this a go. Even though it's... Uh, I feel this is unfinished business that you need to you need to just get on with it, if that makes sense. If it's going to work, it's going to work. If not, at least you know. Wipe the slate clean and move the fuck on. If you have already moved on from this particular person and you're okay with all of this, literally block them off everything and just do a cord cutting and move the fuck on. 